Hey Star Wars fans and collectors, thanks for tuning in to another Black Series action figure review. Just before I kick off, I'd love it so much if you subscribe to my YouTube channel here. And if you gave my video a thumbs up, I would be even more excited. I'll give you a thumbs up in advance right now. We are looking at Hera Syndulla. This is the new updated photo reel paint apps version. Um, I'm going to be doing a comparison with the original one from 2018. Yeah, 17, 18, I can't remember. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll have a closer look. But uh, yeah, she's looking pretty good. I was very desperate for a, for a redo and a re-release and an update because the uh, trigger finger on my old one broke. So um, yeah, I've been looking forward to updating Hera for a while now. So let's open her up and have a closer look. So here is the new updated version of Hera. I actually have her holding a blaster she doesn't come with. Um, I just really wanted her had her hold a uh, cool rebel blaster. Um, she does, does still come with the uh, pistol there that sits in her little holster at her ankle. Um, but yeah, she still has a hard time holding that one just because of the design of the pistol. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm really liking this as an update. Um, I always thought the original Hera was pretty good. Mine had a slight paint defect and her trigger finger did break off on my old one. So I'm, I'm very pleased to have an update um, in the sense that uh, she became quite hard to find really early on. Um, not sure why, uh, she's obviously really popular, which I totally understand Hera is a fantastic character and her story in the Star Wars canon is growing ever quicker so let's get a look at her next to her old counterpart let's see if I can get her to just stand still so yeah definitely not bad by any means but uh yeah the new figure there on the right definitely has a bit more sense of realism um there's a slight change in color to her sort of undershirt there as you can see this one is a little bit brighter um, I don't think anything else is terribly different. Um, but yeah, you can sort of see that misprinting there where it's just been stuck on the shoulder in the packaging and it's uh, yeah, just worn that paint away. So yeah, nice to have a new perfect looking Hera. But uh, yeah, I'm going to have to try and find a suitable replacement for that hand and uh, Maybe I'll try and find a new home for this old, older one. So, yeah, really nice update. Um, yeah, like I said in the Kane video, can't wait to get all these together and uh, do a big group photo. But it's nice to have some bit more slightly realistic m versions of uh, these characters. So, um, yeah, definitely let me know what you think in the comments. Whether it's uh, one that you'll pick up to update your current Hera, or just one you'll pick up in general. But yeah, here's a nice close-up look. Can't get much more accurate than that. I know the photo reel can be a little bit dicey at some times. Um, doesn't always line up perfectly, but uh, yeah, this one certainly has. So next we'll be looking at Ahsoka Tano from Star Wars Rebels. Um, yeah, really, really excited to have. This is my fourth Ahsoka. <laughs> um, I bought the original one three times, so this is the fourth time. And uh, I really want to get these Rebels box, so I'll be buying it a fifth time as well, probably at some stage. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Until next time, may the Force be with you. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.